My name is Darish Chuk and I'm from Belize. Um, I work with a conservation NGO called the Belize Audubon Society and our main focus is protected areas management. We manage nine protected areas in Belize. Um, however, we have support programs such as environmental education, there's a community outreach program and we're also an advocate for the environment. So we're good at lobbying and pressuring the government to come up with the right laws to govern our protected areas in Belize. I've been here for six, going on seven weeks, and I'm part of the Climate Change Fellowship Program. And um, I have an interest in climate change because it's something that's not being communicated in Belize well, and so there's a need for that. I was in Fort Collins, Colorado, and um, when I was there, I was able to see that in the U.S., a lot of people are environmentally conscious, especially in Fort Collins. They're in touch with nature. There's a lot of bicycle riding, which is very good. And so I enjoyed being a part of that. I was able to get a bicycle and ride myself. And I drive all the time in Belize. So that was a new experience for me. Um, I also worked with um, some professors that were working on a climate change project, how to um, use the national park system here in the U.S. to communicate climate change. And I think that's a very good strategy. That's something I want to take back home, home with me in that we already have an audience, people who visit these protected areas who are ready and willing to learn. So um, I could use that approach, using my protected areas and the people that work at the protected areas to talk about climate change and make it simple, applicable, just being in a forest and telling them that it's a carbon sink is something that we can do using the protected areas. I've been here before, but not for such a long period of time. And I've never been in a community that's so in touch with nature. So that was wonderful to see. We've been to the Miamis and the California where it's so commercial. Um, Fort Collins was definitely a different experience and I appreciated that. So I get to see both sides.